Hello there guys and welcome to the first episode of my Fire Red Nuzlocke Challenge. Before we get started in the Nuzlocke, I just wanted to go through the rules of the Nuzlocke with you if you're not familiar with it. So on screen are the rules. First rule is you can only catch the first Pokemon in any given area. So when I step out onto Route 1 in this video, first Pokemon I, I encounter after I get Pokeballs is the first Pokemon I can catch. Yeah, I never start a Nuzlocke before I get Pokeballs because otherwise Route 1 is a bust. Number two, if a Pokemon faints, it dies. So we're gonna be doing everything we can to keep our Pokemon alive. Number three, all Pokemon must be nicknamed. This one's more for making them feel like they're actually yours. You've named them, you've cared for them. Number four, duplicate cores. So basically, if I walk into Route 1, catch a Pidgey, and I walk into Route 2 and a Pidgey appears, I don't want to be catching loads and loads and loads of Pidgey. So basically, duplicate cores says that I can't catch the same Pokemon twice. So if I walk into Route 1 and I catch a Pidgey, walk into Route 2, Pidgey appears, I can skip over that one and move on to the next encounter. And the shiny claws. Shiny Pokemon is encountered. I very much doubt we'll ever get a shiny Pokemon, but if one is encountered, it has to be caught. And within reason, it must be put on the team. Uh, if I have a shiny Pokemon, it will be added to the team. I can tell you that now. But yeah, so let's move on. Episode 1. So, here we are, starting up the Nuzlocke. Press start. Oh, I hate these, in these controls. Blah, blah, blah. I always hate these bits. Right, so we've got Professor Oak. Hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon, my name is Oak. It's a Pokemon Professor. I always love that he has a Nidoran. Female. It's like they were specific in giving him a Nidoran female. So, who am I? Am I a boy or a girl? I'm pretty sure I'm a boy. And let's go with Dan, so D. No, 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 no. Let's go lowercase, come on. A. N. There we go. Yep, that's my name. And my grand, your grandson. I don't know his name. Well, name it Char. Short for Charlie, but not named after Charlie, it's named after Charlene, my wife. Go with that, yeah. Alright, Dan, your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures. Let's go. Alright, first thing I need to do is get on over to the PC. If you've never played Pokemon before and you play this game, Go straight to the PC. There's always a potion in there. Helpful. Small tip, Centrix. So let's go downstairs. I can't remember, do we need to talk to Mum? No, we don't need to. But let's do it. Oh, Oak is looking for me. Let's go find him. Oh, there's some long grass up here. Hey, wait, don't go out! <laughs> Run so fast to get to me. Come with me! He runs so fast to get to me, and then when we walk back, he just walks so slowly. Oh, I've got to walk the rest of the way, thanks. Ah, it's your grandson that you don't know the name to. Pretty, pretty bad, really, isn't it? Very impatient as well. Ooh, free Pokemon. I had no idea there were Pokemon in those walls. But they were just decoration. Ooh, choose one. Be, be patient, Char. You'll get your turn. I have to pick first. I'm more important. Alright, what have we got in this one? This one is... Ooh, Bulbasaur. Yeah. That would make the first gym a little too easy, so no. Then this one, Squirtle. Again, that would make the first gym a little too easy, so no. Amanda. 
Yeah, I'm thinking of this one. I, I don't I don't want an easy. Uh, I want to make the first two gyms a little bit hard. Because then that, you know, helps with adversity. So let's go with Charmander. There we go. Charmander's my choice. Yeah, why not? Alright, so we've got to give this Pokemon a nickname. I've already chosen my nickname. Comment down below if you know where this nickname is from. Z, lowercase, I, B, O, Hippo. Comment down below if you know where that name's from. Oh, he's taken Squirtle. Surprise, surprise, he wants to be stronger than me. Alright, let's get out of here. <gasps> Ten. One. I'll take you on. Okay. So these battles always go 50-50 and even though you die defeated, you aren't technically fainted, so if I die here, it the nurse lock won't end. Again, it doesn't start until I get Pokeballs anyway. Blah blah blah. The trainer makes the other Pokemon faint by lowering its HP zero wins. Yes, Oak, we know this. Too much hand holding. Alright, growl or scratch. Scratch. Let's do that. Inflicting damage on the foe is the key to any battle. Yes, we know that. Oh no, he used Tail Whip. The most devastating move in all of Pokemon. Yeah, I'm gonna keep scratching. And it looks like I've got the advantage. Because I've done the more damage. He's he's not gonna catch me up. Unless he gets a crit. I really hope he doesn't get a crit. I want the XP. And no crit. Excellent. That was a nice one. How much XP do we get for that? Ooh, 70. Good, good, good. We get a level. Defeated Rival Shah. Unbelievable. I picked the wrong Pokemon. No, you just tail it when you should have tackled. Ooh, get prize money. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon battle to toughen it up. He's, he's such a baby. Yeah, Gramps, smell you later. Let's get out of here. Because we have to go run an errand. Uh, let's go up. Do I get the town map yet? I can't remember if I get the town map yet or not. Let's have a chat. Wish I'd seen that. No, not yet. That's the town map though, isn't it? Yeah, big map of the Kanto region. Alright, so let's ha head up to the next town. Oops, push the start menu. There we go. So here's Zippo in all his glory, but we'll look at him later. Speak to this guy because he gives us a lovely, lovely potion. So it tells us about the Pokemart. Okay, so we got our potion. Alright, let's head up through this grass. Oh, oh. Would have been a first encounter, but no Pokeballs, so we're not catching a Rattata yet. Knock it out for the XP though, why not? Good old scratch. And it's tackling, it's not going to do much. It's tackling again. One more scratch should do it. Yep, there we go. Good bit of XP. Alright, let's continue. Get to Viridian City. What are we going to encounter in here? Oh, nothing. Oh, here we go. Again, thankfully for no Pokeballs. And I'm glad as well, not even a level 2 Rattata. Oof. Ooh, and that was a good crit. And 
level 7. We get a new move at 7. We do, Ember. Excellent. Very happy with Ember. And... Oh, that was a long road to Viridian City. Oof. Let, let's heal up. I'm, I'm worried that the, the odd amount of health we took. Very, very dangerous. And all restored. Yep, we will, we will definitely be seeing you again, Nurse Joy. Definitely. If they make you more healthy. Ah, it's good they don't charge money. I was always wondering about that. For at least getting my money. And I can use the PC, which is awesome. I've already used mine at home, so I'll be using that one once I got a few more Pokemon. I'm not worried about talking to you because I have to go to the Boogie Mart. Indeed, I did come from Battle Town. Yeah, Professor Oak is a good guy. A little, little crusty, but yeah. For a parcel? Yeah, why not? I'll tell him you said hi. Guess Professor Oak knows everyone. All right. Back down to Pallet Town. And straight down. Skip over some of these ledges. Make it quicker. Oh, oh, oh. No Pokeball still. And again, level 3 Rattata, so we're not worried. Do a little bit of scratching. We'll be getting our Pokeball soon anyway, so... We'll be coming back up this route in a minute, and we'll be catching our first Pokemon. Looking forward to it. It's going to be one of two Pokemon. It's either going to be a Pidgey or a Rattata. Now, what do I call it, though? Oh, you must be a talented trainer. Oh, you got something for me? Oh, Oak's Puzzle. Oh, it's some Pokeballs. Oh, God, here comes Grumpy. Or Impatient. Oh, you have a request for us? Oh, I love a high-tech encyclopedia. Got my Pokedex, excellent. Blah 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 blah. Ooh. There we go, got our five Pokeballs, which means we can now start the Nuzlocke proper. Yes, I know, I know, I know. Blah blah blah, complete guide, dreams, blah blah blah. This is a great undertaking of Pokemon history. Alright Gramps, leave it to me. Dan, I hate to say it, but you won't be necessary for this. Yeah, right. Aww, I was looking forward to a town map as well. Oh well. Come over these guys give you anything. No, no, do you give me anything? Free stuff? No, no, oh, okay. Right. Nope, why am I going back in? Okay. Controls are a bit funky. Let's go see if she will give me a town map. See how kind his sister is. Oh, awesome. Thank you, Daisy. Obviously, uh, Shah really didn't speak to him. Let's go to speak to Mum. Get our Pokemon healed. There we go. Right, so let's head out of town. No one else will give us any free stuff here, so. What's our first encounter going to be? Route 1. We have Zippo, stats are all level at the moment, which is what we expect. Scratch, Girl and Ember, yep. 
So, first Pokemon encounter is going to be... Not in that grass. Not in that grass either. Oh my god! Not in that grass either. Okay, okay, here we go. And it's a Pidgey! Level 3. I think we can live with that. And we're going to scratch it. Mm, I think we'll get away with one more scratch without killing it. And that's definitely low enough. So let's throw a Pokeball at it. And get our first Pokemon. Now, as this is, episode is going out before I've had any comments, I'm going to give them random names. These, these names mean nothing, it's just names I've, I'm coming up with as we catch them. So, Vigi, Vigi has wings, so let's call it wings. That's what I'm leaning towards. Do we want to give it a nickname? Yeah, of course, always. It's in forever. So, wings, let's call it wings. Do we want wings with an S or wings with a Z though? Let's go with a Z. So, And there we have it. First Pokemon is a Pidgey with called Wings. So let's head up here. Let's go back to the Pokemon Center, get ourselves healed up. Dang these controls. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. Would you like me to heal your Pokemon back to perfectly health? Yes, why not? Thank you for waiting. We've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope you come again soon. Oh, don't worry, we'll be back. It's not often you get free healthcare, right? Phew. Right, so let's have a quick look at our lovely little Pidgey that we just caught. Switch him into the front. Normal flying, yep, yeah, what we expected. Hmm, good, good attack stats, good speed stats, that's good to see. Just one attack right now. I'm going to go do a bit of grinding, we will come back after that. Okay, so that was a good grinding session. Um, now let's go in the Pokemon Center. Alright, so let's get them healed up. Had to go back and forwards a few times, obviously, because Pidgey, it's a little low. Well, it was a little low, it's not anymore. Let's have a look at the Pokemons. So, how are they looking? So, yeah, got Zippo to level 8, got Wings to level 6. So, good three level increase. Attack stats looking good. Got Sand Attack. Might come in useful, might not. Learn any new moves with Zippo. It's only level 8. Alright, I think we should go up and catch our second Pokemon. Yay, it's the guy who drinks coffee and likes talking to kids. I call him creepy. 
Yeah, you, you know I've already caught a Pokemon. Don't you know how to do this? No? No? Don't care? Okay. For a second there, I thought he was going to try and use a potion to catch it. And the old man used a Pokeball. And he magically caught it. Woo! The crowd goes wild. Or well, the crickets go wild, one of the two. Oh, Teachy TV. I will probably never use that. Ever. Right. Let's, um, let's go around and get that item that we saw. No doubt, if I don't get it now, I'll forget to get it the entire game. It'll just be sat there. And it's a potion. It's more useful to me now than it is later. Let's go up and catch Pokemon number two or three. But let's go buy a few bits first. Viridian City's up ahead. Viridian Forest is up ahead, sorry. So we're going to need probably some potions, some antidotes, and some paralyzed heals. We probably won't come in contact with very many to start with, but there are Pikachus in that forest. There's also plenty of uh, Weedle. They are awful for poisoning you. Oh, never go into Viridian Forest without an antidote. And the rest of money and potions. $80 left. Excellent. I can live with that. Let's get going. We're off to see the wizard. The wonderful wizard of the Viridian Forest. Let's see what we can get here. Next Pokemon encounter is going to be... <laughs> Terrible drum roll. No, oh, there we go, there we go. It's a Pidgey. I already have a Pidgey. The duplicate clause is in effect already. Wings knock this thing out. Right on wings. Good old 15 experience. We can live with that. Right. Encounter number two, thanks to the duplicate claws. <gasps> Yay! Unpredictably, it's a Rattata. I think the only Pokemon we could get in this grass is Pidgey, Rattata, and Spearow. So, yeah, we're, we're getting a Rattata. Let's try not to kill this thing. I don't think we'll kill this thing in one shot. No, there we go. I don't think we'll get another tackle off, so let's go straight to the Pokeballs. I love how sometimes it's set on Pokeball, sometimes it's set on Potions. And there we have, we have our third Pokemon. Second Catcher, Route 2. If you're keeping a list, mark it off your list. And of course we're going to give this thing a nickname. And... Let's go with tails. Wings, tails. No, 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 no. I don't like the S. Let's go with the Z. Much better. There we have it. That's probably a good stopping point for today. We've got our first couple of Pokemon. And we've got Zippo to level 8. Wings is level 6. Got ourselves tails. Yeah, I think that's going to be a good stopping point for today. So make sure you comment down below and... Who knows, in a future video, I have a Pokemon named after you. Anyway, make sure you like, share and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.